Well, you'll want to hold off on swimming in the Willamette River for a couple of days. The city says thousands of gallons of a mixture of sewage and stormwater flowed into the river on Saturday. All of that rain playing a role here. Coin 6's Jennifer Dowling is live now with the details on when it might be safe to get back in. Jennifer? Yeah, I'm at one of the businesses that flooded yesterday. Their parking lot, at least, this is the House of Pipes, and there's a storm grate right here, and we're told that that was filling up with water yesterday, all due to those heavy rains, and city officials say uh, they won't give the all clear until tomorrow evening. Now, Portland's Bureau of Environmental Services says over a 23-minute period, 60,000 gallons of combined sewage overflowed into the Willamette in Portland. The overflow was caused by downpours yesterday and came from a single outfall at Northwest 110. And Front Avenue. The problems with the overflow began at around 4:45 and ended just after 5 o'clock. The bureau says people should avoid contact with the Willamette River in the Linton and the Port of Portland Terminal 4 area, as well as downstream until late Monday. Now, this is how a worker at the House of Pipes off Highway 30 near Linton described the scene on Saturday. It really started dumping rain. It didn't even come down lightly, but. All of this right here, everything that was in the road, all the runoff started coming down into here and it made like this little river that, I mean, half of my tire right there was covered. This is the first overflow of 2019. The Bureau says it was 80% stormwater and 20% sewage. Still, things could be worse. The Bureau says before the big pipe project in 2011, there was an average of 50 outfalls a year. So the big pipe project definitely improving things in the Portland area, but still not perfect at this time. So we're expected to get that all clear. Uh, the okay to get back in the river, get contact with the river tonight, maybe around 6.30, 7 o'clock. Back to you, Emily. All right, Jennifer. Yeah, certainly not the worst we've seen, but not something we typically see in the middle of August. Thanks.